Hey, what's going on, everybody? I am back with another banger session. Ooh, this one's sounding so good. It sounds like... Girl, girl, tight. Oh, we're gonna do a very deep dive into this track right here. And guys, I have amazing news. We got a whole bunch of sales going on. My serum pack is going for 50 off. Gingerbread cookies sample pack 50 off. But most importantly, guys, this new Ultimate K-Pop bundle is dropping on November 25th. And this is going to have all my YouTube songs that I release. It's going to be all the samples are going to be there. Plus all the songs that got released, you know, all the songs that I've uh, placed, I've stemmed that I have exported all the drum sounds and I modernized this so you guys can also use for your um, sound. And it's not only drums. There's th 300 plus drum sounds and loops. There's also uh, over 70s. Uh, Core, midi chord progressions of my keys playing R&B K-pop style, but there's also 53, 52, 53 serum sounds that I made a brand new for this year. So it's gonna be a big one, guys. And actually, I made it not too pricey, so you guys can most uh, so the, so that many of you guys will be able to enjoy that. So okay, guys, I'm ready to dive in this song. Girl group type of song, uh, kind of K-pop, kind of R&B, kind of dance, all of that good stuff. Pay attention because it's got a lot of details, okay? We're still in that intro. You know, build. also has like a pulse chorus that happens right here so i'm going to show you that so this is that second chorus right and then for pulse chorus we're gonna hit a big a key change just wanted to do something different there anyways and then we heard him back uh in the chorus yeah guys so this one uh i'm just making this plug as my main thing i think i was really inspired because of this sound um, Aoki Serum Pack. He's got some really nice stuff in there. And then this guy, together with this bass. I mean, it's all about the sound, right? And this sound is just 
really inspiring. Uh, this is also from Aoki. I think, uh, yeah, this is Serum BA5. I love that sound. Together with my drums, it sounds like this. I paid a lot of careful attention to these drums. So bass and drum sounds like this. Interesting groove, right? So what's going on here? Um, so my kick is doing this. And this is very simple uh, kick. I'm really into making simple kink. Kink. Simple kick. Because I want the rest of the stuff to do all the work, all the grooving. So my snare is doing this. And what I love about this is that it's doing that Latin vibe. That boom, cha, cha. I didn't want it to be like boom, ka, boom, ka, boom, boom. It's just boring. So finding ways to make your groove really different, guys. That's a big thing. Uh oh, we got uh, so many elements. Okay, I'm just gonna go one by one because you guys know how big I am with drums. I just really want to make sure all my drums are, and then my snare roll doing this. And then some snare ambient. And we also have toms doing this. Ooh, okay. So what I'm where, what am I doing? I just pick different uh one shot drums that I really like and I love playing them as MIDI and I make my own drum feel basically that's gonna sound way more original something I highly recommend you guys get into a habit of doing right there and then we have another percussion going on here man really I just put like one thing right there right? and then that sound right there and that drum pack that i'm talking about that i'm about to release is going to have some of these sounds there too right there and then my snap we're finally introducing the two and four but as you guys can see this is not just about two and four it just has a lot of latin element to it and more fills. Wow, so many drums. There you go. And then. And then finally, snap ambient. Right there. And then, uh, yeah, it's just that and my drums and some of my uh, vocal chops. Uh. And then when we get to the second part of the verse, it's just gonna get a little bit busier. Mm. What really made this section really nice is this sound right here. Ooh, that guy, that guy. It's a patch that I made a long time ago, Juni Pad movie, and this guy just made a really texture together with this. When you're making girl group tracks, not all girl group tracks, but they love that stuff, like bell stuff, high end stuff, like uh, elements that are more, you know, cute and more like. Uh, yeah, like high, uh, not IQ, EQ range instruments. But make it subtle, don't put a whole bunch. And what is my uh, bass doing? Wait, my drum? Oh, it's not working here. Okay, yeah, so it's supposed to have like a, a drum, I mean, 
808 slide that goes oh i can just show you guys if i go here it's gonna do it it goes probably too high yeah you see that glide is doing a lot of glides <laughs> Yeah, we're just gonna hit the pre-chorus right now. And then what the primary role, primary thing that happens here is definitely the, the, the synth right here. The pulsing synth, but it's the chord progression. Woo! Those chord progressions are like very like poppy taste, right? this section let me show you why it's all of a sudden becoming so big what made it like that so first of all of course we have those synths that i'm talking about the main synths but then we also have this pad see what is this doing this synth is playing around in the middle my pad is playing a little bit lower. Now I need something more in the high range to make it more full. So this is my lead sound right here to make it more full. Ooh, that band at the end. I love that. Okay, and uh, what is that sound? It's also serum. This is also Aoki stuff. Man, I feel like I'm doing like a promotion for Aoki. I'm not getting sponsored by him. Um, so let's check out this thing right here. Yeah, it's doing some. Yeah, so that's the build right there. And we're getting the anticipation going. But are expecting oh it's gonna get big it's gonna get popping you know popping poppy whatever but i chose the other way around to make it very simple and make it into a very um how do i say minimalistic style so it's just that bass going together with my snap percussion Very uh, hyper pop style, right? Together with my the kick. But the main guy is right this this vocal chop. Chopping it right, it's making it intentional, and then yeah, that section is pretty simple. And then when we head to the post chorus right here, it goes into this section right here. So much going on right here. And I gotta start with this bass. It's definitely this bass glide that makes this section so cool. It goes like this. So I really wanted to have a thing where this bass doesn't sound like it's in the core, but it's still in the core. You know, it's all intentional. I'm not just dropping notes. I'm actually kind of going with the chords, but I'm bending it each way so that it'll sound really cool together. And this together with the pad sounds like this. More synth. some more elements bell remember the bell sound that i had i'm putting it here too what 
something I wanted to show you here. Right here, there's a stop all of a sudden, and it's just one fill going on. And I love that part. It sounds like this. Tasty. They're tasty for a few reasons. Number one is because everything is anticipated and then whoop, toot, 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 right? But it's not just that one toot, toot, toot sound. There's another thing going on, by the way. Again, I'm sampling one sound and I'm playing it in. But there's also, I don't know it, where it is, but there's this tape sounding. <laughs> sound right there, you know? It's in there somewhere. I don't think I can find it. And then let's go to the bridge section right here. Mm. Just this is like all about chords, right? This chord made this section and you know, very like steamy R&B type of thing. Uh, not much drum going on, but check this out. When it has a lot of reverb. Yeah, I just wanted to make it sound like that. Look what I did. I basically grabbed a, a loop and I just kind of chopping here and there. It sounded like this. That's another tip, guys. Chop your drum loops and make it very like absolutely in the way that you like it yeah and then i'm building more yeah and then it goes back to the chorus Alrighty, guys did you guys like the song let me know in the comments if you what did you learn is there anything new yeah, but guys, wow, this is coming. Poppy's Ultimate K-Pop Bundle is dropping next Monday, November 25th, 6 p.m. PST. Again, this thing is like nothing you've ever seen. I stemmed out my entire seven years of my career. All the drums, both from the YouTube releases and all from the label releases, I stamped all the drums out and I modernized it so that it will be really simple for you guys to use and it's all mixed ready. And there's also a lot of drum stacks and drum loops is like ready to go. So, and it's not just that, there's also serum, uh, over 50 serum new sounds and 70 over 70 uh, jazzy r&b you know r&b chords that i really love the type of chords that you always see on my stuff that's gonna be there also so check it out be ready because when that drop oh my gosh people are gonna jump in to make songs out of that i know it's gonna be really good so okay guys subscribe like comment uh, I hope you guys have a rest of good week and year. I can't believe the year of 2024 is rent ending. I can't wait for next year. I think it's going to be a great year of breakthrough for many of us. Keep going. Keep grinding. I'll see you guys later. Peace.